and and an authority on Frank Sinatra gives talks. Sinatra's turning 100 in next month. So to Tony. Oh. <laughs> I know, but it's. Not Tony, not, not yet. No, no, no. <laughs> not yet. Not quite. All right. I'm here, nice, <laughs> <laughs> All right. Happy birthday, Doc. All right. So the one thing I remember about London is I didn't go. I stayed home with Daddy, and the deal was that he would take me to a Knicks game, which was my first ever Knicks game. And this is when they were like champion, defending champs. And I thought I got the better end of the deal. Like I didn't have to go to London. I, it, like it, to me, it was cloudy, it was cold. There was no such it was thing. In it was in February. I got to go to see the Knicks. I won. <laughs> you know. So all right. So, next is we're done with. Next is we become adults, sort of. Philip moves to Florida, and I move to the New York area. And Philip took cello lessons down there when he wasn't married, but when he was married, he, he didn't play. <laughs> I don't think there's a direct correlation. <laughs> to ch I think married people play the cello. <laughs> That's Allison, Philip's wife. Give it up for Allison. All right. So then, and when so he took the lessons in uh, Florida, he really improved. He played beautifully because one, uh, his second wife bought a pia uh, a used piano that was very good. And the one time I was down there, so I accompanied him, and it was just beautiful. He had a good tone. How was his bow? I don't didn't notice, but he had a good tone, and so it must have been okay. All right. Now, um, talk a little bit about. Uh, when you and Daddy would go to Tanglewood? Well, we went almost every year. In fact, I, I go now with my sons. The Boston Symphony's summer home in the Berkshires in Western Mass. It's not far from Connecticut, and uh, it's a wonderful place. And Murray loved it. And then, and then Murray sadly passed away 20, almost 22 years ago. And then you've, but then you've made a life since then and moved uh, two years ago into Watermark after living in uh, uh, Fran, and Fran, Fran and John from Watermark, some of my mom's great friends. Fran, do you have a couple of words? I think she had a wonderful life and still has and I'm happy to be here and celebrate with all the family and it's good to meet everybody. And I believe your son g went to Rutgers as well. My son went to Rutgers. My whole family, my brother-in-law, my, all my nieces and nephews, everybody went. My daughter went there. Everybody went to Rutgers. It kind of makes you all who didn't go there wish that you did. <laughs> but don't worry, we're not going to do a whole another RU thing. Uh, well, Would you like to say something, Dorothy? About Fran. about Fran, Dorothy, about Fran, ladies and gentlemen. Fran is the blonde. Fran. <laughs> When I first got uh, arrived at uh, uh, Watermark, which is a home for uh, people a little older, uh, she was the one who invited me to sit with her at dinner, and I still sit with her at dinner. She, it was very nice of her, and she's been a very good friend. And she and, and, John. and John, give it hand to John over here. John is the one at Watermark who helps everybody out. So you enjoy living there. And then a little, uh, and then you, you've met Lori, my love, who is, that's a recent, not so recent actually, almost two years. That's wonderful. And, longer. well, <laughs> my, I can't do everything. It's hard to bend the space-time continuum. I do what I can. Oh, well. I won't say anymore. All right. <laughs> All right. Well, well, I think that's... Oh, do you have any closing remarks? Yes. I want to thank all of you again. I want to thank the people from California. I want to thank the people who came from Virginia. Oh, I, I should have mentioned my uh, son and his wife who came from Florida. And, and and the people from Vermont, and, and and New Hampshire, and New Jersey, and New York, Manhattan. And 
But nobody came from Delaware. <laughs> oh, well. Uh, do we want to ask any questions, or is this enough? All right. Thank you very Dorothy, you're the best interview I ever have had. <laughs> you're welcome. I've done a lot of them. <laughs> yeah. He has a, uh, a, what do you call it? A TV, TV show. show. He has a TV show and he has a, a blog. Uh, a blog. I thought I was going to say a brogue. <laughs> well, Jesus, Mary, and Joseph. <laughs> what you saying? All right, I think there's cake now, or it should be soon cake, and now I... <laughs>